Hi everyone! In this video, I'll tell you what will happen to your body if you do crunches every day. So watch the video till the end, it will be interesting. Let's go! The crunch is an exercise performed by athletes to build strong and defined abs. According to its biomechanics, it is a rise of the body with a slight rounding of the back in the thoracic region from a prone position. As a rule, crunches are not performed by the athlete in the maximum possible amplitude so that the load is constant and the abdominal muscles don't relax at the upper and lower points. Working in a similar execution technique, the load is accentuated on the upper parts of the abs. The exercise has many variations with which you can constantly add variety to the training process and work out different parts of the abs. The main advantage of crunches is the possibility of a comprehensive workout of all the muscles of the abs due to the variety of options. So performing lateral crunches, the oblique muscles of the abdomen are worked out. The reverse crunch option promotes pumping of the lower abs. If you perform it with strict observance of all the features of the technique, you can additionally work out the back muscles, fix your posture and get rid of pain in the spine. Crunches also improve blood circulation in the pelvic organs, which is beneficial for women's health and involves the muscles of the entire body, correcting the imperfection of the figure. At the same time, the exercise is quite simple. Most of its varieties don't require additional equipment. Mat and flat floor are enough. With the help of crunches, you can properly work out the abs in just 10 to 15 minutes. This is a great option for those who prefer to do a quick workout at home. In the classical technique, the rectus abdominis, which is responsible for the six-pack, mainly works. Other variations of crunches additionally involve the transverse abdominis, external and internal obliques, muscles of the buttocks and thighs, and back muscles. Also, during leg raises, the muscles of the arms can be involved, and when performing side plank crunches, all the muscles of the core are worked out. There are many variations of crunches – on the floor, standing in the plank, on simulators, and so on. All options can be combined with each other, including them in a training complex to work out all the abdominal muscles. By standard, crunches are lifting the upper body from a prone position in order to reduce the distance from the chin to the pelvis by flexing the upper back. The crunches technique is as follows. First, lie down on the mat with your hips bent at a 45-degree angle and your feet firmly on the floor. Second, gently raise the upper part of the body, slightly rounding the upper back. The lower back and buttocks should remain on the floor. The chin is not pressed against the chest. The gaze is in front of you. Third, smoothly continue lifting until you feel the maximum load on the abs. Hold for a second in this position, feeling the work of the abs. Fourth, begin to smoothly and under control lower the upper back down. So what will happen to your body if you do crunches every day? A common mistake of a beginner who is just starting to work on oneself and wants to quickly achieve the desired result is training too often. You don't need to do ab exercises every day. It's important to let them rest and recover. It's better to practice two to three times a week, but give all the best, than to fill your entire schedule with workouts. Frequent exercise leads to fatigue and exhaustion. Daily workouts won't bring you closer to the cherished six-packs, but on the contrary, will slow down your progress. By the way, friends, be sure to watch other videos on this channel. The links are on the screen right now. See you soon!